Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Okay, uh, again, this is uh, my third uh, video for CQG Desktop. Uh, today, I would like to share about how to trade on the chart, on the CQG Desktop chart. Okay, uh, first of all, uh, like usually before, uh, please read the notice disclaimer first. About myself, you can read it and if you want to open an account, can uh, contact me here. Oh, this is my name card. Okay, for more video and information, because I will do a series for the CQG desktop, if you like the video, please subscribe and click on the bell to get notified about every new video. Okay, uh, let's log into the platform. Uh, uh, okay, this is a platform. If they say we want to do a chart demo trading, we shall add a new page. Okay. So, of course, we are going to add a candle, a chart candle. This is a, for a crude oil market. All right. Uh, then, first of all, we will see the detail over here. If you want to change the chart, the, 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 the product, you can go to here and select if you want to change to soybean oil. It goes like this for crude oil, like this for the information. Okay, one ticks equal to ten dollar. If let's say you look at ZLE information, one ticks is six USD. Okay. So all the information you can find here. Okay. Uh, this is for the cursor. Okay. And this is to hide or to show the open, high, low, and change on the chart, on the chart itself. And then uh, this is. For a time frame, you can choose your time frame, and even you can choose custom time frames interval in the minute. If you like uh, nine minutes or maybe seven minutes, you can change it to based on those candle. Okay, this is one candle equal to uh, seven minutes, so it's up to you. You you can play with it. Okay. And then for uh, chart types, we have hollow candle, candles, uh, bar chart, and also line. And here we have an area chart and the volume. This is we show we go to the other side. Yes. Okay, but uh, we go for the hollow uh, for the candles. Uh, later on, I think they will add on the Hacken Ashi candle. Okay. So here is the study that you can add. Okay, uh, this one I'm not too sure what is the thermometer and NC thermometer. Uh, for the bar countdown, okay. If 60 minutes are chatting, uh, in another 48 minutes, uh, the new candle will appear. Okay, it will show you what, when how many time left uh, for a next candle to be appear okay this is a session line so market open uh, okay this is the last plus line daily value okay if let's say you also want to cancel this one a symbol watermark if let's say you are you don't like the background of the of that uh, i think it's very convenient for you to not confusing with the, another chart Month, starting month okay so this is you can see your average position let's say you have an order an order mark there all right so for study you can add here or you can add over here okay for example i will add a bollinger band okay here's uh, the bollinger band or if they say you want to cancel the study you just uh, remove it Okay, 
So, uh, how to trade on the chart? All right. First, uh, this is uh, my open position. I have two open position. Uh, sorry, I have two orders and one open position. Long. L is long. S is, of course, short. Go for short. Okay, to enable it, I need to click on this error. So, this is where the order can put it here. Uh, all right, uh, this is where I have a position. I also have a key order here that maybe I can cancel or flat it. Okay, uh, if I want to cancel one, I just cancel or oh, cancel, cancel all, all sell or pop the all I can cancel. For this one, if I want to quick uh, liquidate, I just go here and liquidate it will sell the market All right it's very simple so uh, in the arrow it will show i buy here and sell here okay if let's say you go to five minutes you will more likely to see it okay so uh what else uh, okay for this one if let's say i want to buy market five lots i place an orders it will come here again with the average price time okay and then uh, uh, you don't need to worry that you might uh, wrong key in the order type okay because if let's say you push the price up you can set sell limit buy stop and buy limit but buy limit if they say you put a buy limit it will come on the it will, it will give a exclamation there uh, price is well above market order will may will give a sign of warning may immediately be filled at the market price proceed if you proceed then of course it may market price so if you don't proceed you won't make the mistake huh? okay if you push the price to down Okay, of course you have uh, uh, sell stop and buy limit, which is you can queue, no problem. But if you place the order, but if let's say you push the uh, sell stop also for for the stop loss, you got no problem, you can queue. But if let's say you wrong key in the sell limit, you come out the warning also to tell you that it will match at the market price. Okay. Uh, okay, so this is a stop loss and then this is a stop limit. You can choose it. Okay, for example, if we say I want to use a stop limit, okay, there's a price. Okay, there's a range uh, like five ticks. I think you can change the range on the preferences later. Okay, so uh, if you choose uh, this one is a day if let's say you choose gtc all the order will be gtc good day cancel if you choose good till day you need to put a date uh the order that you choose uh, good till time you can choose a time to place for example uh you know a market will open at 10 but in the morning you have some things to go maybe you need to go shopping to buy groceries or whatever you need to go outside so you know what is the order that you are going to key in so you put a good deal time okay so the order will uh, will only be uh, going into the market at the selected time Oh, sorry, this one is uh, not that one. That one is another one. I will go on another video. Good, this good time is for example, you said you are the day trade player, day trader player, day trade. You know, uh, FCPO, for example, FCPO is closed at 6 pm. So you need to close the uh, position before the market closing at 6 pm. So you put like a uh, now it's 470s so we put like maybe one hour one and a half hours uh order will uh go and trigger okay 
Feel that. Okay, I will not touch the FAQ and FAQ. Okay, again, you can cancel this order or you can cancel all or you can cancel order and liquidate position for selected for this one. Okay, so uh, here is showing I have two orders and uh, five long position. Okay, for this order. Okay, that's it. Uh, that's all. Uh, see you again on the next video. Thank you.